Is it a good idea or no? Hey, it's... Chloe's door doesn't have a warning anymore. Whose bedroom is this? Oh, just empty then. Oh, jeez. Better? Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. Okay. Best wishes. Oh. They bought crutches for Chloe, hoping she might walk again. Uh, she might still be able to someday. Toys? I kind of want to open this and see what's in here. Shoes. <laughs> Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. Spool table? What? I never heard much about William's brother. Alright, sorry for not seeing. First time I've heard about Chloe having an uncle or an aunt. Sit. Oh, high chart. I guess we stopped growing up together. Uh, depressing. At least we never had to hide from step douche. Yeah, at least that. A blue butterfly? I'm sure this is a total coincidence. Yeah, a total coincidence. Try sitting on this thing. I'm still overwhelmed by this new reality. And I feel so guilty for putting Chloe and her family through this. I could give Chloe the choice of keeping William alive, but that would be cruel. But then I see that they're a family again, and who am I to judge? Maybe there's a way to go back to uh, right before the crash. <laughs> that might work. <laughs> Maybe I should get up. Yeah, let's let's get up. And um, let's just let's just go. How's it going, Time Tripper? It's funny. I think I look older. Here it is. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. Let's see here. Nothing here. Hey, is the blue dye still here, or is that just it's cool? Not Chloe uses natural medicine too. Let's see, trash can? No. Okay. Um. 
switch off. And uh, it's all about you, Arcadia Bay, isn't it? Kinda. <laughs> Let's see, Maybe we can look through this. Apparently, oh. the only thing that hasn't changed is this view. Okay. Um, is that Joyce? It's so nice to have you around. Let's talk to her first. Good morning, Max. Ah, oh, you and Chloe are so much quieter now than when you were kids. I remember. It's nice waking up in your house again. Oh, William and I love it. Finally seeing you and Chloe together after all these years. After the accident. How are you doing, Joyce? I'm doing the best I can, Max. I won't lie. It's difficult, but nobody said life was easy here in Arcadia Bay. Plus, you guys have to work, too. Ah, oh, Bill and I have no time for ourselves. And we're working more than we're living. I even had to take a part-time gig at Pan Estates. Ugh. Do you know the Prescotts? I know that Sean Prescott won't be happy until he owns everything in Arcadia Bay. Stay away from his son, Nathan. <coughs> Do you know somebody named David Madsen? He, um, might hang out at the two wheels. Well, that was random. Yeah, he's a, <laughs> a bus driver. He comes in sometimes. Cute, quiet. Why? Oh, um, I, w I was just curious. You always were. Nice to see that everything doesn't change. Yeah, you do have kind of a... We kind of have a reputation, huh? So... What do you think is going on here with all of this eco-havoc? Maybe Arcadia Bay just wants to be left alone. I know the feeling. Honestly, I don't give a shit about too much outside our house. I don't blame you, mm -hmm. Joyce. Except now we have dead birds and beach whales outside our front door. So maybe I should care, for Chloe's sake. Huh. I have to tell you... How much I love seeing you and William together again. He's been such a hero through all this. Chloe and I, lucky to have him. Uh, Is William still the same? After everything that's happened? For better and for worse. But always for the better. I, I never thought I'd love a man so much I can't imagine life without him. Sounds corny, I know. You rule, Joyce. Shit. Things would be different if I did. I like how you think, kid. I wish I was a better friend. I know Chloe doesn't get many visitors. Oh, Max. You're Chloe's best friend for a reason. You're here exactly when she needs you. I hope so. You guys do such an amazing job taking care of her. We can only do so much, and she gets damn sick of her parents. <laughs> That's why it's so important you came to spend time with her. Max, Chloe's condition is not improving. Her respiratory system is very weak, and she... <sighs> she... Do you know what I'm saying? <sighs> Choice. I'm so sorry you have to go through all this. Bad or good, I embrace every moment with my daughter and my husband. This is what it means to be a family, and we'll always be one, no matter what. I better get back to Chloe now. It's good talking with you, Joyce. You too, honey. Wait, was that a chance to tell her about... Hold on. William and I can't believe how much you've grown. Uh, hold on. I need to check something. Good morning, Max. Oh, you and Chloe are so much quieter now than when you were kids. Who helps Chloe out when you guys are at work? 
We have a series of revolving nurses and caretakers. <laughs> Chloe still causes trouble, even if she can't move. Max, Chloe's condition is not improving. Chloe and William seem like they still get along so good. Yeah, those two are closer now more than ever. Chloe will actually listen to William while she usually ignores me. Oh, it's so cute when they gang up on poor old me. You rule, Joyce. Shit. Things would be different if I did. I like how you think, kid. I better get back to Chloe now. It's good talking with you, Joyce. You too, honey. Uh, Nash tray. Huh. Joyce used to hate smokers in the diner. Things change. Joyce is already a super mom. We oh, we can't read the actual book. Okay. It's no. good for Chloe to stay in touch with her friends. Oh no. I didn't realize how bad Chloe's injury really was. Okay. Changing condition. Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, um, let's see. What else can I look at? Look at them. They have no idea what's in their future. Can we go back? With that photo, or no? Just hang out in the past. That is such a sweet or... shot of Chloe. I wonder who took the picture. I know. Things aren't as neat and tidy as they used to be. William is trying so hard. He's still awesome. Dr. Bill. <laughs> Oh, nine, maybe. Yep. Uh, let's see. Let's just. Uh, oh, can we go to into the backyard? I'll uh, take a look around there. to give Chloe her morphine even though it's probably a bad idea. Finally. Uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. And painless. Um, okay, but Get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo, but can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Please, my diary is like emo ground zero. 
Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. <laughs> Thing I can. So Chloe has her own photo album. Anything else though? Whatever, let's just do this. Is that okay? Perfect. Oh my god, look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. What? Really? <laughs> okay. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. Turn page. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Me too. This photo... Maybe I could... Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and... Uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So, I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Um, what? You understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. What? No. No. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, no. <laughs> Chloe. I can't. It wrecks me to see you in any pain. But I don't have any right to do this. I'm an adult. I'm giving you the right for choice. And William, I already said my goodbyes to them, but they won't honor my wishes. You will, right? I, I can't kill you with an overdose. Max, I'm dying from my illness, not my dosage. This accelerates the process. I'd rather go out on a wave than a rock. And I want my best friend to help me out. I am going to help you. But not like that. You have to believe me, Chloe. Why, Max? You're just bailing on me, like everybody else. Why don't you go now? You've been wanting to since you got here, right? So go, and don't come back. Chloe. I am never leaving you again. To let's see, what would happen if I 
Explore all options. <laughs> oh man, there we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Oh Me boy. This, this photo. is good. Maybe I could. This is gonna be a bad idea. But. Listen, Max. Uh, let's see what happens if we accept. Chloe, I'll just drift asleep, dreaming of us here together, forever. Oh God, this is gonna be painful. T Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Sooner than you oh. think. What? No. Come on. Um, really? And time to rewind. I wanted to see what happens if we go with... I don't know. And rewind. There is no way I'm keeping that. Boy, <laughs> William. Wait, what happened? Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Did I break the game again? I think I might have broken the game. Okay, so I'm just gonna choose I don't know and see what happens here. Chloe, I, I really don't know if I can do this. I had another friend who wa wanted to end it all, and I did everything I could to try and save her life. How can I be responsible for ending yours? I mean, th there's gotta be another way. Max, you were there for your friend, no matter what. Now I'm asking you to help me the same way. I want to help you, Chloe, but... I, I think my help is hurting. At least you have a choice. When you want to make a decision, you can just do it. Look at me. I'm at the mercy of everybody. For once. I want to make my own choice. The most important one in my life. Please. Help me, Max. Really? Oh, but... Refuse. Chloe. I am never leaving you again. Look at anything else? Focus on anything else? Ah, for the... I'm sorry, Willie. Okay. Fine.
AD keys. Let's get this over with. <laughs> Someday Dad'll get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Hello? Hey, honey. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Shit, where are my keys? Aha! You can't hide from me forever. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow hey. it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? He's never leaving me. That makes all of us. Oh, jeez. Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I, I did try. I'm sorry. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You have made things different, like my whole life. You're my best friend. I've got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. I'll always have your back. Always. Jeez. Mm, Just focused on a different photograph. Never. Yeah. Keep jumping timelines, you know. Guess not. Well, it was kind of weird being in a different timeline, so. I guess we were going to have to get back to the original timeline anyway, so... Whatever. <laughs> Eesh. Have that happened? Wait, did I just miss a chance to look at the alternate world's uh, journal? Now you're all over me? I'm just... I'm just... I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world. I don't think I can ever tell Chloe about what happened. Yeah, probably not a good idea. <laughs> hmm. 
Hmm. Am I supposed to get up? Spacebar, maybe? Or should I just keep it like this? <laughs> Let's look at the big board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. Now, one second. Um, reload last. What was the last checkpoint, anyway? <laughs> It. Okay, um, give me one second to play the zoom game. Okay, so I've decided to go back and take a look at uh, how the journal is different in this wor world line. Okay, so September 4th. Sure, I could slow down time. <laughs> Blackwell rules. Vic and Nathan. More fashionable. Too. The most beautiful straw pork pie hat. Real shiki style. Best also drunkest. Whoa. Okay. Max busy busy. Cat right now. My shoe. I don't want to call it too. But my vortex first party. <laughs> what? There's only those pages? What? Okay. This is, yeah. uh, sure. Okay, so it's not much to see here. Okay. Okay, well, um...